Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I want to share with you my mini collection of my small SLG, um, well it is SLG small leather goods uh, from Louis Vuitton. Um, I started collecting um, or started my obsession with this um, what do you call it? Um, I guess your luxury item um, about four or five years ago. So uh, no particular order. I'm just going to go ahead and um, start sharing you what I have right now. And currently I'm very satisfied with my collection. I don't need anything else, you know. Um, so yeah. And for the most part, all my SLGs are um, in monogram. So yeah. So I'm going to start with my key clay this one this one <clears throat> this item has been with me um all the time it's always in my bag um i mean i did try using this as a uh key holder um i guess you could use it and then you can um just put your driver's license um and some card and maybe uh folded bills inside and then you can just attach it to attach your keys here and then and just carry it like that so i guess you could do that as well you know but i've always used it just to put my extra cards and and that's it and it always comes with me um whatever bag i'm using so i love this piece um i think when i got this one there were I'm not sure if they were 190 or 200 dollars but i think now they're um yep the price are really um getting up there so this is the monogram key clay right here then the next one i have the monogram coin for uh coin purse yeah round coin purse so this one i've had for a few years as well um it's got some uh fading um on the little pull right here but overall it's in pretty good shape um the leather bachetta it's already patinaed um so which is fine and i, I just removed all my coins because you could tell it's a little puffy i guess because i put too many too much coins inside so that's the inside it still looks pretty good after um being used for i mean i use this all the time you know so and that's the reason why i got it so it's for coins so so far it's held holding up very well um aside from just minor tarnishing right here but you know there's no scratches there's no nothing so yeah so this is the round coin purse in monogram and then this one is the mini pochette also in monogram um this is made in france and also this one has the gold part i mean i'm not sure why the color always turns into silver color i'm not sure why and the rest keeps its color it doesn't change this one right here but this um i'm not sure what this is called this little hook thing um that's the only one and also for the speedy that's the problem with the where you put the um, shoulder strap but other than that everything else looks pretty good just minor tarnishing and a pull and I use, use this usually for just a catch-all or just little items and always um, this thing is always in my bag so and I use it for a catch-all um, yeah so so far it's held up very well after I would say four years four or five years um, the first year I was um, introduced with Louis Vuitton, I, that's when my obsession became. Um, you can't just get one. Um, I started out with the Speedy 30 in monogram. 
but I later sold that one because I couldn't stand the Pachetta leather getting stained or um, dirty or anything like that. So I sold it and uh, sold it and then got the Damien then instead. But so yeah, and then this one is the only dummy I've been in a small leather good that I got. I haven't used this one in about a year or so. Um, but yeah, originally I got the PM size in monogram, but unfortunately this part broke. And I also realized that it was too small for me. So the medium size is perfect and also fits in most of the bags. And like I showed on my um, last video, I think this fits on the Kira um, Chevron bag. So yeah, and this one I've had probably three years. And so far it's in very good condition. Nothing is peeling, nothing is falling apart. You know, so and then the inside, yeah, everything looks pretty good so far. Granted, I haven't used it in about a year and a half, but I'm not gonna get rid of this. So yeah, so this is one. And then I also got the Kiragami set. Um, the smallest one is the one I use all the time, which I put in my um, extra cards inside. This one has a maroon color, which is very nice. And it comes in three. I did the unboxing on this one, so if you guys want to check that video out, I'll probably link it here somewhere. So this one I've used a couple of times, and this one comes also in the bright red. Um, lining so yeah this is so pretty very functional there you go and then the largest one comes in a light pink inside I still have the thing in here this is yeah this is the code I'm not sure if um, I know they raised the price on this one ridiculously. Now this one I got uh, with the purpose of using it. Uh, my daughter and I was supposed to travel last year to Asia and unfortunately it was canceled. And I was gonna use this one to put our passport, boarding pass or whatever flight related paperwork. So I was gonna use this one for this. But unfortunately, I never got to use it yet, hopefully soon. So this is the biggest one, and there's the medium size, and this is the small size. This one I use all the time. It's always in my bag. So, and I like it that it has the brass um, button, which um, doesn't um, change color, because I think some of them has like a different color. I'm not sure. So. There you go. Love this pig. Uh, for the price, I think when I got it, it was under 700. And for the price, and you get three items, which is excellent. So that's that. And then, okay. And then I have, I guess you would consider this small leather good, small bag. I haven't used this one in a while. This one, I believe my husband gifted this to me um, during my obsession time. But yeah, this is the Eva Clutch in monogram. There's the inside. And I always keep them in their dust bags and it's, it's gotten the patina already, which is uh, very nice doesn't have any water stain or anything like that um, and this is the, um, the strap um, you can remove the strap and use it as a, a little shoulder bag if you want to 
or a wristlet, but I usually just use it as a, a crossbody bag, you know. So, and unfortunately, this is obsolete. Um, and yeah, yeah, you can still buy them um, from a pre loved market, but they charge and they ask for so much money, you know. And the plate is still in excellent condition, doesn't have any scratches or anything, but yeah, love this thing, it's very cute, functional, yeah, so, so this is never going to leave my collection. I think when I, when I say collection, I don't really collect them, I just, you know, I use them, it's not like it just sits on the shelf or anything like that. And then this one, I had the monogram, never full and medium. That one I sold as well because I couldn't stand the Vichetta. Um, couldn't wear it when it's raining or snowing or anything like that. I sold that, but I kept this one. Um, so yeah, usually I would wear this like, um, I mean, before I used it to like, if I wanna, do a quick um, grocery shopping or something like that. But lately, I've been using something else, but maybe in the summer, I'm gonna start using it again. But yeah, this is a very nice addition. I'm not sure if you can buy this separately or it just comes with the Neverfall, yeah. So yeah, this one I love. And then I, of course I got this one. This is the toiletry 26, um, which I just did a video in converting it to a mini bag. There we go. I haven't used it yet, but there you go. This one is also made in France. So I would love to start using this as a mini bag. Hopefully it doesn't damage my zipper thingy. You know, but so this is the toiletry 26. And the next one is my full size zippy organizer wallet. This one I've had for eight months already. Yeah, July, what's the eight months? Every day I haven't, I haven't switched out of it every day this is what i use this is what's in my bag this is the only wallet i have and and i love it i can't say you know enough good things about it it's very functional at least for me of what i need and yeah so far so good nothing is uh peeling nothing is coming off no threading is uh you know showing no tearing or anything like that. So yeah, so this one, I also did a review on this one if you wanna go ahead and check that out as well. And then the last one in my collection, which I just got um, for Valentine's Day um, for my husband, which is the um, Hard to Find Mini Pochette in Damir Ibn. So, this one I haven't used. Um, it has the red interior lining, just like the, my um, Speedy 30 in down here again. So, which now I have both of them. There you go. So, I think it's the same size. I'm not sure if the newer version, newer model is there, a little bigger than the older one. I'm not sure what do you think so that's that so anyway um don't forget to check my uh, Louis Vuitton giveaway with uh, the key clay um, so check that out follow the instruction and yeah so make sure you submit your email address and just let me know what state you're from and yeah so like the video and hopefully um, you know, we'll reach our goal of having uh, at least 500 subscribers. I think that's pretty good. So yeah, we have a long way to go, but we're getting there. 
so I'm not losing hope so with your guys help I'm sure I can accomplish that so anyway so that's my mini um, Louis Vuitton SOG um, collection and I hope you like this video until next time my friends thank you so much bye bye